everybody. I am here to introduce to you the IBDP Math Application and Interpretation course. I hope by the end of this video, you understood what this course meant to you. But first, guess what would be the top 10 highest paying jobs for the year 2021? Use this picture as a hint. I'm going to give you three seconds. Have you gotten an answer? Let's check your answer. These are the top 10 highest paying jobs for the year 2021. As you can see, the top four jobs requires you to use data. In fact, to interpret them. And that's what Math AI is all about. Here is a snapshot of the differences between Math AI and Math AA. You can see that statistics and probability has the highest number of hours, in fact, teaching hours, and which means to say that you will require to use data and interpret data within this course. All these four math courses have six objectives. They are knowledge and understanding, problem solving, communication and interpretation, technology, reasoning, and inquiry approaches. To understand more on how these six objectives are being met in Math AI, kindly refer to this textbook. You can find this textbook in our library. Many students think that Math AI SL is an easy subject. Let's hear from your senior. Hello. Can you name me one thing why you chose Math AI SL? One of the reasons I chose Math AI SL is because I enjoy uh, looking at statistics and working with statistics. And that is um, something that um, we do in Math AI SL. So that is what encouraged me to pick this class. Okay. Do you think Math AISL is easy? Uh, no, I do not think Math AISL is easy. It is challenging, but I am working um, like by studying and by asking my teacher questions so I can perform well in the class. Thank you. <laughs> what your senior is trying to refer to is that in Math AI, the hardest part is actually the technology component or the technology objective together with communication and interpretation. Here, you can see that under assessments for Math AI, you will require you to use your calculator or your GDC for all your papers. Unlike AA, you can see that for paper one, you require you with no calculator. So which means to say that in Math AI course, graphical display calculator or your GDC will be your friend. I hope I have answered your queries about this course and gave you an opportunity to make an informed decision on what course serves you well. If you have any questions, feel free to email me. Thank you.